Hello everyone, Dan from BMW Sudbury here again. And in this video, we're gonna take a quick look at the all new 2022 BMW 230i Coupe. So this particular one is in Alpine white. It's a classic BMW color. And actually, what, as we're at the hood view, you can actually see that power dome hood standard on the 230 and of course the M240. And as we come down to our headlights, so this car has the premium package, so you have the adaptive LEDs, and you can actually see there's a gold accent in the headlight as well, or signifying you have the nicer headlights. And then this portion right here, that little ribbon, is your daytime running lamp. And come on the front of the vehicle, we have our active kidney grills, so they are closed right now, since it's a little cold out. This car has our standard 18-inch wheels with all-season tires. So it's the same wheel design shared with the E3 Series. Side mirrors with our turn signals. Of course, we have that newer style door handle. It's debuting on a lot of new BMWs. The new 2 Series Coupe as well as the uh, 4 Series Grand Coupe. So it's a little more of a sleek design. Let's come along the back. Rear three-quarter view. Our tail lights, and dual exhaust, even with this being a 230, just like a, a 330i. It's dual exhaust. And kind of a unique diffuser there towards the bottom. And you can see there is no X Drive badge right here on the trunk lid, so this car is rear wheel drive, best drive, as BMW calls it. So the first batch of 230i coupes coming out for a little while will all be rear-wheel drive and the M240 is all all-wheel drive x-drive so let's go ahead and pop the hood let's open the hood see our two liter four-cylinder engine Makes 255 horsepower, 295 foot pounds of torque. Same engine shared in the 330i. But definitely peppy for a four cylinder, just like it is in a 330. If you want a little more power, really a lot more power, you go with the M240, which is 382 horsepower out of the turbocharged six cylinder. And I close the hood. Side. So this car has the Cognac perforated sense attack. You can see the perforations on that part of the seat as well as the bottom. And let's hop in. Seat back a little bit. You see our steering wheel, cruise control, and media functions as well as heated function as well. And our 12.3 inch live cockpit display. And this car has the premium package, so you do have the head up display, so that's new for the 2 Series Coupe. Previous gen did not have a head up display available, even on the M2. Come down the center console, you see our newer style shifter, and center console buttons this is mirrored from a 3 Series, as well as our heating and ventilation controls. And our 10 and a quarter inch center display. You see our rear camera there, which is standard. And there's our main menu. So I have a power moonroof with a power shade as well. So that's from right here. So you close the shade. With the power function. In the previous gen, that was a manual shade. And you can see on the door, you have that triangular pattern that's kind of mirrored on the M Sport and M240. On the uh, front bumper. Two person memory, normal uh, window and mirror controls. Go ahead and look at the window sticker. So 2022 230i Coupe. So base price $36,350. So this car has the premium package as well as remote start. 
and your destination, so 41695 for this car. And let's just keep in mind this car is rear wheel drive, it's not X-Drive. Cool, let's go out. Take a quick look at the trunk. The trunk space is very similar to the previous gen. It's a little bit bigger, I would say. And of course you have the little pulls there as well. You can fold the rear seat, fo uh, rear seat forward. So if you have any questions on the new 2 Series Coupe or any other BMW for that matter, feel free to leave a comment down below and we'll be happy to get back to you. Thanks, see you in the next one.